just really annoying. <laughs> so, um, yeah. That, is, that was that. And then this thing. This thing. I know I already have a heavy pottery vase on, but I kind of forgot about it whenever I found these. And I don't know. <laughs> I just. I need these amount of erasers in my life, just so you know. Okay, because I, I told my parents that by the time it's the end of the month, I'm only gonna have like two of these. Which I mean probably is an over exaggeration because like they, like my dad said, I'm probably gonna give most of, these away, most of these away. Because I mean, I don't mind helping out someone who needs something. And I mean, look at these. Look at these, those um, does it say how many? There's a hundred erasers in here. No one person needs this many resources. So, I mean, of course I'm probably gonna give them out to people who need them. I mean, yeah. So let's see, there was one that says, Superstorm, excellent job, bravo, incredible, great job, and way cool. But yeah. I don't know. This is probably excessive to most people, but I mean, when you figure that you can probably give most of these away to someone who really needs an eraser, I don't know. Seems kind of worth it. But um, yeah, that's that's that, and I think that might be all of my school supplies for right now. But um, let's go ahead and let's get into clothes okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna show you guys one of my tank tops because I have like one two three four I have like three other colors of these and like it's just a tank top with a little um sewing th I don't know what it, this is called exactly because I'm not really a fashion expert but um, it has like this little stitch in the middle to make it look cuter, I think. <laughs> and I have this in red, this kind of orange, yellowish kind of color. Does it, does it say what kind of? Cringe front, that's what it is, cringe. It was on the tip of my tongue, I knew what it was, it was cringe. And then I have like this weird light tan brownish color, can you guys? see that but like isn't that like a tan <laughs> or oh, what most people would call skin color <laughs> like oh it's not tan I need the skin color crayon I need to color in this person's skin and then I also have another white one but um <sighs> the life of having a very overprotective parent and brother <laughs> but um yeah so, um, those go with a couple of these, um, shots because my mom doesn't want me to show any skin. And I'm just going to go ahead and say, I think two of these are crop tops. And I've never, I'm okay, I've owned one crop top, I think, in my entire life. And it was cute. It was like a two-piece kind of crop top. It came with its own little tank top underneath it. And it was cute, I liked it, but like, because it was like together and you couldn't pull it apart, my head would always get in a weird position whenever I tried to put it on it would get, and it would get stuck or something. And like, I don't know, it's just, I threw the top piece away and I kept the tank top and I made it into what I will for my BB cos cosplay. Which I'm gonna try to change up some because I actually found something that I can use to make it better. So, um, yeah, um, but, um, I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys the tank crop tops. Excuse me. The crop tops that I have. The first one that I have is this Friends crop top. It has Chainlaw, Rachel, Ross, Monica, uh, Joey, and Phoebe. Yes, I actually watched the show. I'm not one of those people who just wear a freaking Friends t-shirt just because they think it's cool. I actually watched the show 
obviously. <laughs> Even though it's... Isn't it like the 25th anniversary? I keep on seeing a commercial on TBS for it. Like, 25 years anniversary, we're still here. So, I don't know. I really like this show. My friend Riley got me into this show, and... I don't know, it's really cool. <laughs> like, at the end, I'm kind of hoping... Ross and Rachel end up together. But I don't know. <laughs> but yeah. I think they do, but I can't really remember. Because I'm not really... I haven't seen the full series yet. I've only seen, like... I've seen enough to understand what's going on. But I haven't seen the full series. But, um... Yeah. So, the next tank top... Not tank top. Crop top that I have is this Hogwarts one and I have I have a love-hate relationship with this <sighs> and it'll stay up I have a love-hate relationship with this one it's yellow and two because of it being yellow the Hufflepuff emblem isn't yellow like, the inside of it is, but the it's the inside for all of the symbols and emblems and, um, oh my god, what's... House Crest, that's what it is. And, like, I don't know. You can't really tell what the color of Hufflepuff is. I mean, I'm not a Hufflepuff, don't get me wrong, but, I mean, I still kind of care because no matter if... I'm not a Hufflepuff or not, I'm pretty sure that Hufflepuffs all around are kind of upset about this, in a way. But, I mean, I don't know. And then it doesn't even go with the, the um, Slytherin one, because Slytherin colors aren't, aren't they like, silver or green or something, or like gold or, I mean, and then Ravenclaw, I know for a fact Ravenclaw's colors are, uh, silver and blue. So yeah, I have, I have a love-hate relationship with this. I'm still gonna wear it because, I mean, it's Harry Potter, of course. But, I mean, I don't know. I have a love-hate relationship with this. It was only 10 bucks, though, so I mean, I don't know. I have a love-hate with- Oh my god! And then look at the W! Look at the freaking W! It doesn't even look fully, like- if you look at the rest of Hogwarts, it looks all pretty and everything, but then you look at the W and one of the, um, like, this part right here, like, that, this part right here, looks like it's all messed up and everything. And, like... I don't know. I like the fact that it has the little, uh, I'm not sure if it's a saying, but the wands at the bottom. I'm not really sure what they mean. I'm sorry. I'm, I know I'm kind of acting like a muggle right now, but I don't, <laughs> I know that that's Draco Malfoy's Dormillion's Nan, Nan Clum. Isn't that like a professor? And then Toto named this. I don't know. I, f I don't really know what those mean. <laughs> I'm sorry. Please don't call me a fake or a poser um, because I've actually seen the um movies. I haven't read the books because I want to, but it seems like every time I go to the library and I try to get the books, because I want to read them in autumn, but every time I try to get the book, one of the books to start reading, it's like, they're all out. So, um, yeah, that was 10 bucks, and let's see what, how much this other one was. This other one was 10 bucks, so both of the crop tops were 10 bucks. And then another one, another one, one of my favorites. I'm not sure if this is from the newer one that came out, or the older one, but, like, it, it confuses me, okay? But, um... I'll tell you why in a second, alright? But, um, it's a 
no boys. I mean, that last one gets a crop top, but it's like one of those shorts that it's longer in the back than it is in the front. And, like, yeah. It has Simba, Timon, and Pumba. And, like, the reason why I'm confused about it is because, like, you know how for the live action one, they're still using the original characters for their merchandise? I don't know. Like, I wish that they would use, like, their own animation for it. But, I don't know. That's just my own opinion, because it kind of confuses me. It's like, oh wait, they're bringing out 90s. They're bringing out the 90s Lion King, and they don't have any march for the, uh, for the new one. But, um, yeah. I don't know. And then here was another Harry Potter shot. This one fits me very well, because I am a Gryffindor. And I wish they would have these for the other houses too. Because I feel like most places only have stuff for Gryffindors because that's the main house in people's opinions. Because, you know, Harry Potter is the main character and he's a Gryffindor and you mostly see the parts of Gryffindor houses and stuff like that. But I don't know. Okay, that's just, to me, that's just unfair. <laughs> I mean, I get that. Gryffindor is supposed to be one of the main ones, but like still People who aren't Gryffindors like Slytherins for example, they still want to show off like their own House pride and stuff like that So why don't they don't why don't they have like versions of these with like Ravenclaw and Slytherin and Hufflepuffs? Am I just being too picky? <laughs> I mean, I don't know this doesn't seem fair. I mean, it's I don't know. I guess I'm just lucky, but like, I don't know. I wish they would have these for all of the houses. Cause, like, I don't know. Like this shot right here. I know I'm going back to this shot, but like this shot right here. This is probably one of the first ones that I've seen that is like, it's given out some Hufflepuff pride. Whereas, I don't know. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Like, this really makes me mad. I mean, I know if you go on to, like, Hot Topic or, you know, Second and Charles or something like that, you'll find, like, your house pride march. But if you don't have a lot of money, like $25 for a t-shirt, and you want to get a t-shirt for like eight bucks, this is seven eighty-eight. You can't if, if you're not a Gryffindor because they only have Gryffindor themed stuff. Like it seems really unfair. Like why should any other house have to pay more money just because they won't put into a different house? Like they should be able to show their pride too, not just Gryffindor. <laughs> like honestly they, they that makes me mad I mean I'm glad that for once they actually did something in honor of Hufflepuff cause I have I think maybe a few Hufflepuff friends but like I haven't seen anything at these cheap stores for like Ravenclaw or Slytherin or even like anything with the Hufflepuff sim symbol on it except for whenever it's the entire house crest I don't know, this makes me mad. <laughs> this makes me really mad. I don't know why, but like, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the last thing that I have. This is the last thing that I have. Sorry about that main, main bullying. But, um, the last thing that I have is this really cool looking skeleton with roses shot. I mean, it's not a t shirt because it has like this little. Thing. I don't know what it does, but like, I guess I'll find out whenever, uh, I'm wearing this tomorrow on the first day of school, by the way. <laughs> or that might be one of my other ones. I don't know, but, um, yeah. This is just a skeleton t 
tea shot. Shot. Not tea shot. It's a shot. But, um, yeah. Is that it? That's it. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Um, that's all of my clothing for right now. They had a Riverdale crop top kind of thing at Walmart like a few days after I went. And if I would have had money, I would have gotten it. But I think it was a crop top or something that said Vixens. And I really wanted it. But if I see it today, I'm going to I'm gonna convince my mom to get it for me. Because <laughs> it was like blue and stuff like that. And, and it looked really cool. Like that's one thing I want to get. I want to get some Supernatural t-shirts. Some Supernatural t-shirts. And I want to get some Riverdale t-shirts. Because so far right now, the only fandom that I can... I can express is Harry Potter and Nightmare Before Christmas because I don't have any Ruby t-shirts, I don't have any Supernatural t-shirts, I don't have any Five Nights at Freddy's t-shirts, and I don't have uh, Riverdale t-shirts. So that's a goal that I want to do. Maybe I'll do that for like Black Friday because I know Hot Topic does like $10 t-shirts. So I want to get like maybe 5 or 6 so I can get free shipping. Because orders over 60 bucks are free shipping so like I'll probably get some more stuff too depending on how much money I have on Black Friday but um yeah that's one thing I want to get. I want to I want to show my love for these other fandoms that I'm a part of. Because so far, the only ones that I can show my love for is Night Before Christmas and Harry Potter and then a few bands that I like. <laughs> so, like, yeah. Um, but yeah, that's it. Um. Wait. I think you guys want to see my... You know what? I'll probably just put that in the different video if I decide to go with that one. It just depends on like how much uh how much room or how much stuff I have to get. So um yeah. You know what? Hold up. So I finally found it. <laughs> and like it's kind of a oh god what is in here? Oh Oh, well, I guess I don't need paper now. <laughs> so, um, I finally found my other paper. Yay! But, um, yeah, um, hold on, let me zip this up so maybe it'll be easier. This is gonna be a really long video, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> but, like, I don't know. I guess most of the time I was just rambling about random stuff, but um, yeah. But um, here is ow my hair. Struggles with having long hair. But um, here is my little book bag that I made sophomore. I didn't make it. I tried to. I had a different one that I had that I had painted with fabric paint, but it just ended up ended up tearing up and everything. And it looked really cool. But, um, this is really cool too, so, yeah. But, um, I got a I Need Space patch. I have a Supernatural patch, and yes, I know that the wings are not hot glued. Yes, I used hot glue, I know. But, um, I know that it's not hot glued or anything because, I don't know, I had the idea of making it, like, be able to move, like, wings. So yeah, and then I have a Batman one, even though I'm not that big of a fan of Batman. I only put this on here because I know that Tim Barton made one of the Batmans or two of the Batman, Batmans, 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 two of the Batman, <laughs> two of the Batmans movies. So um, that's the only reason why I put it on though. I don't even really like Batman that much. I just wanted something. Tim Barton sort of themed, kind of, I don't know, but um, I have a Panic at the Disco 
patch. It has a little Panic at the Disco symbol. I have a Fallout Boy patch, and then I have a Deathly Hollows patch. I wanted to get a Gryffindor patch to put to put on him too, because I found one at Target, but I just I didn't have enough money, and when I finally went back to Target, because I don't go to Target a lot. I've I haven't been in a few years, <laughs> so yeah. I think that whenever uh, I finally went back, they didn't sell it anymore. What is in here? Oh. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. Wow, this is just memories. <laughs> Sophomore year was probably one of my best years, honestly. Like, I met so many sweet and amazing people who I miss dearly <laughs> and yeah oh my god <sighs> oh god I was an idiot sophomore you know I tried to make my own little wand because I didn't have a wand and I wanted a wand so I used a straw that wasn't used and I tried to make a Gryffindor colors <sighs> oh god <laughs> I need to clean this out some and just throw some of the stuff away. Oh, here's a, here's a Sharpie. It's a Sharpie. I need to put this up somewhere. But yeah. Oh no, it's ripped! Ah, It's like ripped in the inside. Are you kidding me? That sucks. Like, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but like, right? Yeah, you guys can't see it, never mind. Aww. I guess I can't use this then. It makes me so sad. That does, it makes me so sad. Well, that's a bummer. I mean, I guess I can use it for like, the amount of days that I need to, but like, I don't know, just, I had some good times with this book bag, but like, I don't know, but yeah, sophomore year was one of my best years ever, <laughs> like, oh my god, I think one of my favorite classes was art. <laughs> Because, like, I've mentioned these guys before, my little art family and stuff like that. I miss them. <laughs> and going into senior year, I hope I can do the same thing that they did for me. I hope I can make some lower classmen's lives a lot better than they were. Than they are. And I hope I can make them smile just as they made me smile and laugh and... I met some soft, some freshmen last year who I absolutely love, but I don't know. Hmm. Well, I think that's everything, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna stop this before it becomes a 50 minute video because I know you guys do not want to go through that. I'm gonna try to edit it the most that I can, but um. I'll see you guys next time, and until then, keep your clothes dark and your hearts bright, and don't let society bring you down. See ya!